This is Muttley Crew. She's an absolutely lovely little boat. She's 36 feet long. She was built in 1999 by Piper Boat Builders and fitted out by Midway Boats. And for a 36 foot long boat actually and a 6 foot stern deck, she's got an awful lot of accommodation I think. Absolutely fabulous condition. She was fully repainted at Baxter's in 2019, blacked at the same time. The paintwork's it's a lovely job, it's still really good condition. There's the six feet cruiser stern I mentioned. The engine's in here, it's a Beta 32, very well maintained, serviced every year. Nice and clean and tidy. The batteries at the top of the screen there. There are two domestics, 110 amp hours and one starter. They were all brand new in 2020, just last year. Get a feeling for the paintwork here. It's a lovely colour as well, actually. I don't know what they call this colour. There we go. She handles like a car as well. She's an absolute dream to drive. And she's so cosy. I absolutely love this boat. The well deck itself is three feet long. Gas locker is in the bows there. One 13 kilo bottle in there. There's room for another one. Water tank is under the well deck here. That's stainless steel, 430 litres. Nice glazed front doors. And then we go into the saloon. Boat's fitted out an oak face ply with oak trim. There are a couple of opposing couches here. One's two seater, one's three seater. There's a demountable table there that sits in between. These do make up into a spare double bed. So the boat sleeps four. There's a wall mounted 18 inch TV DVD there. A couple of little cupboards, one above, one below the television. Been so well looked after this boat, I can't stress that enough. It's really cosy, really sweet. Solid fuel stove, that's a Caroba, that was new in 2013. The bathroom and the kitchen were fully refitted in 2013. Head height on the boat is 6 feet 6, by the way. All the lights are LED. So the kitchen was all new in 2013. It's a microwave here. The fridge is under here. It's an inlander, 12 volts with an ice box. Nicely concealed behind these cupboard doors. Stainless steel sink. And there's a fair bit of cupboard space in this kitchen. The windows, there are seven of them. They were all removed and resealed in 2019. Squeaky clean oven and grill. And there's a two burner gas hob on the top of that little cupboard here. There's the gas hob. That's a full straw actually. There's a cupboard underneath. So all the windows were out and resealed in 2019. Along with the mushroom caps on the roof actually. And there's a view down through the galley and towards the saloon. Just slot in a little video of the table erected there. On we go. Bathroom's next. It's in here. Everything you need in here, nice ceramic sink. Big mirror. The loo itself is a Thetford cassette. There is a spare cassette on board. Little cupboard under the sink there. And the shower itself is a vinyl lined cubicle, thermostatic mixer taps, and glass bifold door. So this was redone in 2013. Lovely little room. And the bedroom's at the back of the boat. The bed itself is six feet two inches long, four feet wide. There's a lot of storage under there. The hot water tank's under there as well. Actually neatly squirreled under the bed is a fishing umbrella. There's a, a tiller attachment for it so you can have that while you're motoring to keep the rain or sunshine off your head. Half wardrobe with shelves in at the foot of the bed. And then steps lead out onto the stern deck. The stern deck is six feet long. And there's the view from the helmsman's position. It's good space on the back here, actually. So back through the boat we go. 
There's a little 15 watt solar panel on board to give the batteries a trickle charge. Hot water is heated by the engine. And there were two surveys relatively recent on the boat, one in 2007 and one in 2013. They're both in the office available for viewing. She's got all the necessary navigation equipment to just turn the key and go. Absolutely charming boat, I love her. That's Muttley Crew. For further photographs, a fully downloadable brochure and the price, go to our website www.rugbyboats.co.uk.